Hi, today I'm going to share with you about um, trying to repair my running shoes. The sole is coming out. This running shoes, uh, yeah, I was running and walking with it, and I realized uh, the sole has come out. Yeah, so I bought a glue from a hardware shop. This glue from a hardware shop. Um, yeah, I actually went online and see people say that this glue is good, so I'm going to try and see whether it's good or not. Um, yeah, so do wear a glove, uh, I wear my gloves and I get a chopstick and I use it to scrap the glue up. I get some glue, a uh, wooden chopstick, those disposable chopstick I use to get the glue. You can use a brush as well. So me, I, I just get this uh, since it's available. So I use it to open up my shoes and paste it. Ooh, just brush it, yeah. Brush it with the wooden stick, chopstick. I use a wooden chopstick. You can use a brush also. La. So for me, I, I'm used to Getting this, uh, recycle the uh, chopstick, disposable chopstick. Okay. So making sure every part uh that come off uh yeah, is glue. So get a uh, take one. Take glue. This glue is a thin one. It's not those uh, small little tube one. Um, yeah. So normally the couplers get all this this kind of thin glue to glue the shoe. So I'm hoping that this glue will work. So brush evenly at all corners. And uh, wear gloves uh, to protect your hands. By the way, this glue is has a sun smell. Uh, if you are don't like the smell, wear a mask. Uh, yeah, to block the smell. Okay. Okay. Now the side. Area, put it evenly on the side area, brush it, okay, so brush it evenly, mm. we'll get yourself a newspaper to Put your shoes because it's dirty. Since we are running it, walking outside, your shoes is dirty. So, you make sure every corner, every side, at the bottom, they all have glue. Okay, and then you press on it. May yeah, I just making sure every side has the glue? You need to put a lot of glue. So those tube of glue may not be sufficient, so you have to get a thin glue. Okay, now you have to press. Making sure you have the press over hard as well. Uh, making sure that every portion of glue is on your shoe, the, the sole that came out area. The I find that the back is very difficult to put and apply to put the pressure. Uh, so the back part is when you have to put a lot of pressure. The Left side, uh, yeah, I make to sure that I put enough glue as well. Okay. 
Hur? I think my running shoes is because uh, previously I went for a hike and then I, my shoes got dirty, I wash it. So water probably got into the shoes and the soles and uh, it become not sticky and it came off uh, after a few use of my shoes. So yeah, just be careful on this. Uh, yeah, washing of the shoes may cause the glue to come off very easily. <laughs> Uh, okay, so now press hard, press hard, press hard to try to get it to stick. You need to apply a lot of pressure on it. Okay, a lot of pressure on it. Press hard. Okay, press, press, press. And the side edges, the, yeah, it's very difficult to press. Okay, making sure every area must be pressed harder. Press. This one will take some time. Okay. Right, press, press. Okay, I now I put some, yep, uh, yeah, packs into my shoes to try to hold it. Okay, put some packs to hold it. And I'm also trying to use a like, rubber band <laughs> to see whether it can hold the shoes instead of me trying to hold it for very long. Yeah, trying a few methods to see whether you can hold it. Okay. Rubber band. My rubber band is not long enough, I think, to do two, two round. Got problem, it snap. Hey, yeah, it snap. So it's only one round, I find it not effective, unless you have a longer rubber band, a bigger one, then probably you can do uh, two rounds. Uh, clothing, Back right, uh, can actually grip the shoes, hold it a bit for a while, but you must get a big pack. Uh, uh, yeah, a bigger one. I find the orange pack is better versus the white pack. Uh, uh yeah, the small pack, this orange one. So, the glue, yeah, glue it. Um, uh, okay. It will take some time to really stick. 
uh, yeah. So, so you need to be patient to yeah, making sure that it is glued well. Yeah, try to hold it yeah, as long as you can. You know, you have to use a uh, clothing uh, pack. The gap, uh, I call it uh, gap, the hockey call it gap. Yeah. To hold it, hold, 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 hold it. Hold it. Hold tightly, press. Okay. Press. Hey, I got myself a hammer to hammer it and give it more pressure to stick. Stick it. Okay, pressure. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Okay, hammer it. Try to get it stick. Um, yeah, give it pressure to hammer it, to stick it. So there's quite a few things I use. Yeah. Hammer, chopstick, glue, clothes back, rubber band. So you need to get all these uh, things before you try to glue your soles or your running shoes, your sneakers. Emma. I'm going to use a glue gun. I'm going to take out the pack and use a glue gun. Okay, this is normal white glue. Normally, this the glue gun is actually for the craft uh, glue. I'm going to try to glue it and seal it. Okay, glue gun. Uh, glue gun takes a while to get hit up, uh, so I use the time to actually press the shoe. Okay, press the shoes while waiting for the glue gun to get hit up. Okay, press it, press. And hammer some more. Okay, yeah, take out my, so,
Okay, have uh, the center portion. Taking away in a so to have the center portion, just so I didn't have it. So making sure every portion is being hammered so the shit it can be sealed tightly. Okay, sealed tightly, hammer it because you need pressure to stick. Okay, now the glue gun it should be heated up. Yeah, the glue heated up. Okay, some glue into it. Okay, put some glue. Okay, glue. Okay, glue. Glue it, glue it, glue the air just that very difficult to seal. Okay. I'll put the glue, uh, yeah. The things uh, I use in this video in the description now uh, you can buy online in Shopee. Okay. So the glue gun and glue, this stick glue. And the thin glue as well. If you're interested in the sole, I also put it in as well. The yellow sole, that one is good for comfort and to protect your legs, your feet. It has a better support. You glue it. Glue and then you press on it. Okay, now I have glued my shoes and let it dry for a while. And then now I'm trying to test the shoes. See, it, it, it jump. I mean, it drop off or not the soles. Walking around with it. So far, it seems that it's okay. Well, another thing I want to walk around is because walking with my body on it, give some pressure to it, it will stick better, okay, it will stick better, okay, your shoes needs to actually uh, hang out to dry for a few hours, let's leave it there for like 24 hours to let it dry, you need to dry it, see this is the shoes I have to uh, glue it, it looks anxiety, but it, uh, yeah, at least I can still use the shoes uh, a bit longer life. 